Oh my god, this girl. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, excuse me. Oh, Hi. I'm so flattered, thank you. I have a boyfriend. Sorry. No, you're. Oh my god. Are you serious? Oh my god. What's up guys, it's your boy Benny. Things are about to get more embarrassing for Mike Pence. I know that's hard to think that it's even possible that that happens, but it is happening and it's happening at Mike Pence's own Judas-like hand. Check this out, this is a tweet from Mike Pence yesterday. Check out the Pence plan. Mike Pence's plan, what's his plan? Well, Mike Pence in this video goes to a gas station and he puts gasoline in a red truck. And that's what the video is all about. But a number of sleuths online have noticed a few things about the problem with old, old lunch pail Mike Pence walking up and getting a tank of gas. See if you can spot some of the problems in this video. Mike Pence here. Remember $2 a gallon gas? I do. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Okay. So, zoom in on the zoom in on the uh on the gas nozzle there. Your hand isn't on the nozzle. You're not pulling the little clicky thing at the handle. I don't know what the technical term is. You're not pulling the little handle. Have you ever gassed up your truck? This is, you're not pumping any gas here. Let's go. And then Joe Biden became president of the United States and launched his war on energy. Since that time, gasoline prices are up 60 percent. Electricity prices. <laughs> do you hear the do you hear the beeping? Beep, beep, beep. That's what happens when you're not filling up actual gas. The thing keeps beeping at you. You ever filled up a gas tank before, Mike Pence? He clearly hasn't. Good old lunch pail Mike Pence, working man. Nope, dude, you're humiliating yourself. The gas tank is beeping at you the the ga the gasoline machine is beeping at you the gas stand is saying why aren't you filling up your car with gas beep 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 and mike pence's handy little microphone there tied to the underside of his shirt which is what of course, i'm always mic'd when i get uh, a tank of gas uh is picking up the beep are up 25 percent. Joe Biden's war on energy is causing real hardship for working families, small businesses and family farms. But we've got a plan to relieve all of that. We just unveiled the Pence energy plan that will not only put our country back on a path to energy independence, but by 2040, we will reclaim America's role as the leading producer of energy in the world. Join us in the fight for American energy leadership by going to MikePence2024.com. We can lead the world once again to a more prosperous and a secure future for America with energy independence and American energy leadership. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> Who is running this shit show? <laughs> Look at this thing. Get it. You, you won't need any gasoline, Mike, when you're getting nuclear ratioed into the sun. This is 4,000 comments on this video. Uh, 700 retweets. Uh, this thing is getting just absolutely blown up. Steven Crowder says, has he ever pumped his own gas before? <laughs> no, clearly not. That's not my concern, is the response to Mike Pence not filling up his own gas tank. That's not my concern. Of course, the legendary Tucker clip. Mike Pence saying, hmm, America, that's not my concern. You know, you have to actually have to squeeze the handle, right, Mike? Yeah. Yeah, you see, there's a Mike Pence. Mike Pence is not squeezing the handle. This is not, he's not gassing up. How are you doing this? How do you do, fellow gasoline consumers? <laughs> Hello. I also like gasoline. Carrie Lake's War Room. We didn't know you could pay at a gas station with 30 pieces of shil silver. Ooh, the 30 shekels, Mr. Judas. Oh, Carrie Lake, what a, a spicy boom. <laughs> oh my. ALX, the great producer of this show, executive producer of this show. Uh, is this the video that everyone's talking about, Mike? I assure you it's not for the right reason. <laughs> 
ALX is on Mike Pence's uh, text message list for some inexplicable reason. Mike Pence just released a brand new video. See it for yourself. Everyone's talking about it. Not for the right reasons. Mike Pence needs me. Sorry to bother you. Mike Pence needs you to rush $1 to him to help him reach the gas tank and actually fill up his car. Afford to actually fill up a tank of gas. So you can't afford to buy a tank of gas? Is that what you're trying to sell us? Mike Pence committing career suicide, saying he doesn't know if Donald Trump committed a crime on January 6th. Yes, a total Judas. And the American public is seeing this, obviously. You can see here in the polling, you can see DeSantis is the pink line and Donald Trump is the, the blue purple line, bluish purple line. Donald Trump up here at a commanding 55, 53%. Mike Pence down here with 5%. 5%? 5.2%. Yeah. I think there's a difference between 5 and 50. The American public is responding. This is real clear politics. You can see the polling here. Again, Mike Pence is muddling in the fours and five percentages. Fours and five percentage points. And why is that? Well, it's not because of his humiliating uh, gas station video. It's because of this video where Tucker Carlson ended the man's career. Maybe January, we'll let somebody transfer some jets. I'm sorry, Mr. Vice President. Have you? I know you're running for president. You are Thank distra you. You are distressed notice. that the Ukrainians don't have enough American tanks. Every city in the United States has become much worse over the past three years. No. Drive around. There's not one city that's gotten better in the United States. Thank and it's visible. Our economy has degraded. The suicide rate has jumped. Public filth and disorder and crime have exponentially increased, and yet your concern is that the Ukrainians, a country most people can't find on a map, who've received tens of billions of U.S. tax dollars, don't have enough tanks. I think it's a fair question to ask, like, where's the concern for the United States in that? Well, it's not my concern. Ooh. Tucker, I've heard that routine from you before, but that's not Ooh. my concern. It's not my concern. That's all you need to see about Mike Judas Pence. It's all you got to see with Mike Pence. America is not my concern. It sure ain't going to work when you're talking about the price of gas when you say it's not my concern what's going on inside of America and the destruction that's happening here in this country. Mike Pence has taken a horrible path here, become a, become a simp for the super state a simp for the forever war party. He is a total neocon. He is sold out and betrayed. The only reason that he's relevant at all, which is Donald Trump, a man who brought Mike Pence out of irrelevance and put him on the national stage as an icon, actually, for our party. And that is, those are terrible attributes, awful attributes. Not that you were planning on voting for Mike Pence, but don't do it. And also, Stop debasing yourself and humiliating yourself with gasoline videos. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> oh man, so embarrassing. Our channel's not embarrassing though. That's why you should like, share, and subscribe. It's your boy Benny, see ya.